The successor to the original phablet, the Samsung Galaxy Note 2 is a corker out of the box, but here are five ways to make it even better. Tip number one, photo editor. If there's one thing that's great about the Samsung Galaxy S3, it's the camera. And with its fantastic six frame per second burst mode, the Samsung Galaxy Note 2 just betters this. That said, the incredible Samsung photo editor isn't on board out of the box. To get the best mobile photo editor out there, all you'll need to do is open up the Samsung Apps application. It'll require an initial setup, but once you've done that, just search for the photo editor, install it, and you'll be able to finesse your pictures with little more than a pen swipe. Tip number two, contextual menus. The Samsung Galaxy Note 2 builds on touch with Nature UX by adding context sensitive menus. What does this mean? Well, just pull out your S Pen and the S Pen applications populate a new home screen. Plug in your headphones and your music widgets take center stage. You can toggle these menus by tapping the cog in any of these pages. Tip number three, bin your search bar. By default, there's a Google search bar taking up the space of four potential shortcuts or folders on your home screen. What do we say? Can it? Why? Because there are two ways to access your Google search in Google Now on the Samsung Galaxy Note 2 with little more than long presses. The easiest way only really works from your home screen, and that's a simple long press of the menu key. This pulls up Google search. The second requires you to pull up your task manager by long pressing your home button. Once the task manager's up, centered at the bottom of the screen is a Google search shortcut. Hello, extra home screen space. Tip number four, customize your keyboard. Samsung's original Galaxy Note was a piece of cake to use with two hands, but one-handed typing on it was short of impossible, unless you had oversized appendages. Samsung's ICS update, however, brought with it one-handed mode, something that's made its way onto the Note 2. Just dip into your keyboard settings, activate one-handed mode, and your keyboard will lean either left or right, depending on whether you're right or left-handed. While you're in your keyboard settings, you can also switch on continuous input. This enables a swipe-style slide-oriented input method. Tip number five, hover to preview. Taking full advantage of the S Pen, not only are there 1024 levels of pressure sensitivity, but you can also hover over certain elements to preview them. This works in text messages and videos, for example, with the latter giving you a pop-out movie player preview of your video.